सो हेलो एवरी वन आई एम श्रेष्ठ आई एम ए सॉफ्टवेयर डेवलपमेंट इंजीनियर सो वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद दिस लीड कोड प्रीमियम टॉप इंटरव्यू प्रॉब्लम सीरीज वील बी डिस्कसिंग ईच एंड एवरी प्रॉब्लम विच आर मैंशन ऑन द लीड कोड टॉप इंटरव्यूज एंड ऑल्सो दिस विल हेल्प यू टू क्रैक योर नेक्स्ट कोडिंग इंटरव्यू इन द टॉप वॉच प्रोडक्ट बेस कंपनी सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द प्रॉब्लम we'll look at this problem uh, from lead code top interview questions that is unique path so it is basically a dp problem but it can also be solved using maths so today we'll look at the recursion and how we can optimize the recursion by using memoization so let's look at the problem statement so it says that there is a robot on a matrix the it is initially on the top left corner on the 0, 0 index and uh, it tries to move in the bottom right manner he can only move either down or right at any point of time so we have been given these two integers and we need to find the possible unique paths and the test case generated says it is uh, 20 to 10 to the power 9 so uh, it is mentioned that we cannot use recursion directly so it will give us a tle kind of thing okay so uh, let's try to visualize this problem uh, what it says so basically we have been given this sort of grid and uh, there is a source there is a destination and we need to reach this place and we have only these two moves we can either move in this direction or in this direction so what are the total number of ways total unique paths so let's try to visualize it for a smaller problem so we have our robot is present here and he wants to reach this d position so let's say in moving the total number of ways while via this path is a and this path is b so what will be the total number of ways so the total number of ways will be a plus b okay this is true so what if this function give us the answer so we can just pass solve 0 comma 1 as uh, as this is 0 1 this is 0 1 okay and this will be 1 0 so this expression will give us the answer for this problem so let's draw the recursive tree for that how the things will take place so initially we are at 0 comma 0 so from 0 comma 0 we can either move to 0 comma 1 or 1 comma 0 okay from 0 comma 1 we can either move to 0 comma 2 or 1 comma 1 from 1 comma 0 we can either move to uh, 1 comma 2 or 1 comma 1 so likewise the recursive tree will go so what we'll do we'll just add the answer that will be given to us by these two sub tree by these two recursion branches okay so let's try to code this once and uh, we'll try to get what uh, how actually the problem flow will go so um, uh we'll have a obviously for using memoization we'll have a dp array okay so this dp array will be made as per our constraints so it is mentioned that it is 100 so we can use 101 okay so now <clears throat> uh we'll also define two variables i and j J is equal to zero, and uh, let's say now uh, we'll first write the boundary cases. So what will happen if uh, i is greater than equal to m, or j is greater than equal to n? So we'll just return zero. Okay. Uh, the second case is if i is equal to i m minus one or j uh, and this will be and 
so we have reached that goal so we will just return our answer we will just return one uh, and if uh, dp of i and j exist in which we are storing all our answers uh, then we will just return this okay uh, else what we will do we will just return dp i j is equal to um, okay unique paths oh uh, unique paths uh, what we will do we will first look for the we have two options either down or right side okay uh, so here it will be i and j plus 1 so this will be our final result so we just uh, took care of the boundary cases and uh, this case will be because we are already reached so getting to that position will return one only and uh, if we ha already have a path we have stored it uh, the path uh, value and also uh, if it's not the case we have traversed the uh, both the sides so let's try to run this one okay just a spacing issue So it got accepted and uh, the overall uh, time complexity uh, will be a big O of uh, m into n uh, that is n squared kind of time complexity and the space complexity will be same because we have initialized this dpr okay so i hope you guys have understood this one uh, try to submit this and we'll meet you in the next session thank you